In our coverage of the pandemic tonight, concern over a new surge facing the state and Fresno County. Health experts paint, pointing to the highly contagious Delta variant. Our Adrian Thomas stands by live here at the Fresno County Health Department tonight with more on this. Adrian. Alex on Stephanie, just this afternoon, the Fresno County Health Department reported there are currently 116 hospitalized COVID-19 patients in Fresno County. Now, they say this is a sharp increase after a steady decrease in hospitalizations since February. Local health officials say we all need to take precaution regardless of our vaccination status. We are uh, really entering another surge. Um, this is happening uh, across the country and across the state. A surge caused by the Delta variant, according to public health officials. Interim health officer at the Fresno County Health Department, Dr. Ray Vora, says he's urging people to wear masks indoors, regardless of vaccination status, to help slow the spread. This comes after the CDC issued similar guidance this week for everyone to wear a mask indoors if you're in an area of a high rate of transmission. We know it's inconvenient. Uh, to ask people to mask up again. I fully recognize that it is. However, it's a really small inconvenience compared to uh, the benefits that it has. Another troubling statistic, the County Health Department reports since May, emergency room visits due to COVID-19 symptoms have increased dramatically for those 18 and under. More 18-year-olds are admitted to local hospitals than those in the 65 and over age group. You're seeing it grow up upwards to 20% almost here. This is concerning because the under 18 population is not not all they're not all eligible to be vaccinated. And so their only protection is the people around them. Dr. Vora also says his team has already begun talks with the city of Fresno on city employees being required to show proof of vaccination status or undergo weekly testing. I think it totally makes sense. You know, I think once you understand what this disease is doing, um, then it's really uh, clear that this is this is largely a pandemic of the unvaccinated. It's really, you know, something that all cities need to be considering. Now, larger cities like San Francisco and Los Angeles already have similar measures in place for city employees, as does the state for state employees. For now, live in Fresno, Adrian Thomas, KC24, local news that matters.